Hello, thanks for joining me on this wonderful Saturday. Today I'm going to be shaving with this Gillette new long comb. And I have the handle from my, um, my ball and tech on it. It works, the threads are the same. I have a Gillette platinum blade, I think it's a third use. Um, this came with just uh, the end piece, as you guys saw in my last video. And uh, I just screwed this hand on because it looks good and aesthetically. And I said, ah, give it a try with that. I'm going to be using B Pure Soap. I'm going to be using the Dollar Tree Witch Hazel. Skin bracer for the, uh, the aftershave. Got my uh, septic pencil if I need it. And uh, I'm going to be using something different. I picked up a vintage brush the other day for five bucks. It is a Williams. 403. I sanitize it. It's a very small knot, but uh, I'm going to give it a try here. It'll be the first time trying it out. I've got my Badger, the one I normally use, and we'll see how this goes. Very soft, but it's like I said, it's small. Give it a try and see how it works. Oh, uh, no, sorry, no head shave, uh, middle of the week. Emergency came up. I had to travel, but the good thing about it was, is while I was where I was at, they had a huge Dollar Tree, and I uh, picked up a five pucks of B Pure soap, biggest Dollar Tree I've ever seen. It puts the one in my area to shame. So I'm not bowl lathering, by the way. I'm just trying to load this brush up the best I can. And you know what? I forgot a towel, but you know what? I'll use paper towel. I've got some behind me, so. All right. A little bit of water. See how this goes. I also picked up uh, recently. I found another antique shop. I was out and about. And I picked up a Gem Junior from the 30s. Mint, never used. Well, this knot seems to work all right. I don't think I'll re knot it. I've been uh, looking into that, re knotting a brush. But this seems to be working out okay. So, I mean, if I gotta load it up again, so be it. All right, let's give it a whack. Yeah, it seems to be working good. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be clogging up as uh, much as, say, a tech would, and it's a little more aggressive. I didn't expect that. Wow. I expected this to be just as mild as a um, pre-date code tech, and I am wholeheartedly wrong. Wow. I'm impressed. I have to get a um, Razor Emporium sells a... Uh, Reproduction handle. I'll have to pick one up when I have the funds. They're pretty expensive for the gold plated one. I think it's 50 bucks. But I mean, this works out just well for the meantime. It's not a priority. And I'm not sure if this one had the, the bar handle or if it had the old style handle. So I might, I'll do a head shave tomorrow. I've been kind of debating it because our weather's changing. 
air. <laughs> and it's getting cold. And I, I even when the, I don't have, uh, I let my hair grow a little bit. I'm debating it. Got two days of growth or something. I didn't say that. All right, get a second pass down here. Let my face don't need to, but this is such a small knot. Figure I would. So be pure soap, I am set for quite a long time. And that was my objective with that, because uh, you never know when they're going to stop making stuff. And I've also got Williams. Got a cake of that. I went back, by the way, guys. And uh, she said, oh, I can get more, I can get more. And I get back to that drugstore, and she gets on her computer, and just as I thought, nope. <laughs> she can't get more Williams, which stinks. And she didn't have any in the back like she said she did. But I was in the area anyways, so. No big loss. Alright, second pass. Yeah, bristles are coming out of that. I don't know if that knot's any good, but hey, if it's no good, I will uh, re knot it. I've been watching videos about that. And this sucker's aggressive. I'm not complaining, but oh yeah, wow. Well, yeah, there we go. The lather could use a little water. Whatever's left I'll get. I'm gonna do an actual pickup pass today, so. I'm going to try to get over this blemish without cutting myself. Alright. Let me rinse off here. I'll get a piece of paper towel. And Rinse off. <laughs> I 
I'm not complaining though with that Williams brush. I only paid five bucks for it. And I see them going for, uh, I don't know, 15 to 20 bucks. New in the box like that. Okay. Hey, pick a pass. Lucky brand Dollar Tree. It's got a different smell to it than uh, Dickinson's, but that's all right. Works the same. Same alcohol content. Ain't gonna smell it anyways over the uh, over the aftershave. So. This isn't Ben either. I'm kind of surprised how aggressive this is. I did not expect that. You know, Gillette's always been middle of the road with uh, with their razors. And that's what I expected this one. Wow. Need a little more witch hazel in that one spot, and I think that'll be BBS, guys. Well, I've got a bunch of razors to review. I got um that shade, I made a shade razor out of the um the Dollar Tree razor. I've got the Gem Junior, and I got that um, pocket open comb old that's made in uh, Canada to review for you guys. So, no, oh, uh, good shave. I'll get the aftershave on here and I'll call it good here. Skin bracer, good stuff. I get mine at Dollar General for four bucks or three fifty a thing. No irritation. Wow, not a bad shave. All right, great shave. Uh, I got all them razors to review. I might do the head shave tomorrow. I got to put the clippers to my head again. And uh, might as well do it now before, uh, before it gets too cold. So I want to thank you if you stuck around to the end here. I'll be reviewing them uh Razors here in the next coming weeks. Um, I have some new other uh, new content here coming up as well. It's getting close to hunting season around here, and uh, yeah, I might do a video or two. Nothing drastic or anything, but I got some scouts I got to do before the season starts. So, all right, I'm gonna keep you guys. Thank you for watching. If you have any comments or questions, please comment down below, and I will catch you guys later. And happy shaves. Bye.